This matter case is in relation to the death of Jeremiah Yinu, a Salvation Army student who was mistaken by PNGDF soldiers and badly assaulted in July last year. He was taken to the Port Mosby General Hospital but died a few weeks later. Uh, because we have a deceased who have died as a result of uh, injuries sustained. The new evidence includes two separate medical reports from two doctors, one who treated Yinu and the other who conducted the autopsy. Kalaud said the delay in police presenting this evidence in court was because they had to wait for the two doctors to release the medical statements. The postmortem conducted on the deceased and because uh, we needed uh, the medical evidence to be placed on the file to prove that the deceased died as a result of injuries sustained to his uh, uh, skull. Yesterday, Magistrate John Kaumi struck out the case on the grounds that police did not compile the investigation files on time. The murder charges against the six were also dropped. However, Magistrate Kaumi told the police prosecution that they were at liberty to bring the matter back to court upon presentation of new evidence. But the matter was not dismissed by the uh, district court. It was only strike out, meaning that the police uh, at liberty to reactivate this case and from the command I would like to make it clear that uh, this matter will be reactivated and all those uh, uh, accused person or the defendants who are soldiers uh, they will be asked to report to Broco police station on Tuesday for them to be rearrested and uh, new information will be laid and at the same time the files will be served on Tuesday upon their rearrest. Tekla Gunga, National MTV News.